Yep. So apparently this weekend, a movie has come out that is the true story about what is supposedly the most daring Coast Guard rescue in U.S. Coast Guard history. But I'm gonna review this movie first. To be fair, it's because I saw this movie first, but let's just embrace it, folks. Let's just bask in my absurd lack of priorities, because that's me, Jeremy Johns, movie reviewer and man of shit priorities. <laughs> Fifty Shades of Black. So Fifty Shades of Black should be a gold mine. It should be easy as shit to make this fun, enjoyable, and funny because it's making fun of Fifty Shades of Grey. We'll see what happens. I was kind of interested in this movie because Haunted House 2 is a bad movie, but there were a couple scenes in there where I was laughing really hard. It was dumb, it was stupid, but it happened. This movie, I don't think I laughed. I chuckled once and it's in like one of the last scenes in the movie. I'll spoil it for you right here. Fuck, I'm not gonna make you sit through an hour and a half of this shit to get to it. He's gonna to whip the girl and there are a bunch of whips from iconic scenes and movies where a black dude got whipped you have like glory 12 years a slave Django Unchained all these different whips and it goes over and it says Joe Jackson it's just a belt there I laughed I was like it's pretty funny the rest of it holy shit was a movie made that is actually worse than Fifty Shades of Grey I mean well, granted for completely different reasons this movie has no wit there's no charm there's no there's no humor behind the jokes it's like this movie was written by someone who does not understand humor it's like Spock was like I'm gonna write jokes for Fifty Shades of Black. I think this is funny. At least that would have the left brain logical kind of humor. This just, it didn't have humor. Every joke in this movie is so simple. When you see the setup, you know exactly where it's gonna go and you're like, but they're not gonna do this because that's the easiest, oh God, they did the easiest possible version of a joke for that scenario. Every time, bar none. Every time. Bummer is I saw Marlon Wayans on Jimmy Fallon. He seems like a cool dude I'd want to hang out with. He's not a guy I would want to write a movie for me though. No. It's like when they're trying to be clever in this movie, it's just awkward, and that awkward moment could be edited out, but they didn't edit it out. And when they just wanted to phone it in, they'd make a dick or ball joke, and that's that. There's nothing clever about dick and ball jokes. People make that in elementary school, and then people kind of grow past it because they're like, hey, my brain is expanded, I'm smarter, I'm more intelligent. The tendrils of humor can reach farther than they did when I was in sixth grade, but not here. Not ever. And like I noticed in a lot of other Marlon Wayans spoof comedies, it's not like its own thing. It's not like Airplane. It's not like Naked Gun. It is a recreation of scene for scene for scene of the movie it's spoofing. Which makes you kind of bored because you're like, I've seen it and I know now exactly where this movie's gonna go. Which would be fine if the jokes were funny, but the jokes were not funny. Guys, in the end, it was one of these things where I was like, they're making fun of Fifty Shades of Grey. I feel like I should watch the movie. Let let's just see where it goes. Mm-mm. Instant regret. The movie wasn't funny. The people in it weren't funny. The humor was awkward or it was just toilet humor, dick and ball humor. Really simple as shit that its target audience can't even buy a ticket to because they're not old enough to watch the movie. Yeah, Fifty Shades of Black is dog shit. What the fuck do they keep making these things? Why does it happen? All right, so Fifty Shades of Black. Have you seen it? What did you think about it? And if you have, I am really sorry. And if you haven't, what's your favorite spoof comedy? Whatever it is, comment below, let me know. And as always, if you like what you've seen here and you want to see more, click right here to see more.